things are continuously shifting in the modern world, but there are some constants in the universe that will never alter. The truth is that a guy should always be able to take care of himself, no matter what the circumstances are, and there are certain talents that every man should become proficient in, regardless of the era in which we live. After watching this video, there are going to be some individuals who believe to themselves, that's toxic masculinity. It is not hard to comprehend. We are experiencing a widespread epidemic of mentally fragile guys. They have been led to believe that men and women are identical through a process known as brainwashing. In this video, we will discuss six life skills that are essential for a man to acquire during his lifetime. Learning how to fight is priority number one. It makes no difference if you are a successful business person, a respected physician, or a talented comedian. You can't claim to be a man if you don't know how to defend yourself. Although getting into brawls or street battles is something that everyone should try to stay away from, this does not mean that people shouldn't learn the fundamentals of fighting. Let's discuss a scenario that, at some point in your life, might apply to you. You could be walking down the street with your wife when all of a sudden, another man approaches and slaps her on the butt. What steps would you take if you were in this situation? You cannot count on calling the police because they will not wait around for them to arrive. You may choose to fully disregard it, but then you would lose the respect of your girlfriend as well as the respect you have for yourself. Nobody should be able to touch the people you care about and love without fear of repercussions, and this includes physical contact. You'd be surprised to learn how many men in this day and age have chosen to overlook the problem and are now attempting to justify why they didn't do anything about it. Protecting the people you care about is one of the responsibilities that come with being a man. By turning a blind eye to a predicament of this nature, you have betrayed your own honor and abdicated the guardian position you were supposed to play. Pay attention, because I'm about to tell you something important. You should never start a fight if you can avoid it, but you can find yourself in a situation in which you have no alternative but to protect yourself. If this is the case, you should be familiar with how to make a traditional knuckle sandwich and be able to do so in the shortest amount of time feasible by landing a knockout blow. You should start by fooling your opponent with a few fakes, and as soon as he lets his guard down, you should deliver a hard straight punch directly to his chin. Do not deceive yourself into thinking you are capable of fighting because if you do it wrong, you will inflict more damage on yourself than on your adversary. Actually train your fighting skills. The capacity to defuse tense situations comes in at number two. Knowing how to fight is a must for this ability, hence the two go hand in hand. You should always try to calm down growing situations by using diplomacy and firm persuasion. This is true regardless of how skilled you are in the art of combat or how powerful your fighting abilities may be. Being able to bring people's emotions under control or stop a conflict automatically makes you a leader. It's like when the dominant male gorilla enters into the room and all the other male gorillas immediately halt their antics. Because of his status, the alpha male gorilla is able to maintain order among the other male gorillas. The only individual who actually possesses mastery of the ability to defuse conflict is the one who is also capable of being dangerous. Because of this, being able to fight effectively and having the ability to defuse conflict go hand in hand with one another. Thirdly, make sure you have a powerful presence. Have you ever been around certain men and been struck by their commanding presence? This man has such a commanding presence that when he goes into a room, he immediately commands respect, even though he never says a word. What if I told you that rather than a supernatural gift, these individuals truly had a skill that can be acquired via practice and training? You have to understand that this presence is the result of the accumulation of a great number of insignificant things and behaviors. You need to be a powerful man who can provide a firm handshake, look people in the eye when you talk to them, walk with your chest out, and look people in the eye when you do so. When you make eye contact with another male, you are expected to recognize that person by nodding your head. The fact of the matter is that charisma is a behavior that can be learned, a talent that can be developed in much the same way that we learn to walk or practice our vocabulary while learning a new language. Now, let me start off by saying that a lot of guys try to fake these things, but it never works well for them. Everyone is able to see a liar especially the kind of person who tries to intimidate others by exerting as much pressure as possible on their palm or by staring directly into their eyes. Avoid being like this other person. 
The most effective strategy for acquiring this ability is to surround oneself with self-assured and charming individuals and observe how they handle themselves in social situations. When you are in the company of men like these, you will unconsciously begin to imitate their conduct, and over time, you will finally build your own powerful presence. Fixing problems is the fourth most important skill to have. It is not necessary to have a background in engineering or mechanics in order to be able to mend things. But if you want to be a man, you need to have a fundamental understanding of how things operate and the ability to fix them when they break. It could be anything as straightforward as repairing a flat tire or clearing out a clogged drain. These are fundamental abilities that should be ingrained in every guy. You should also have the initiative to learn how to do it if you don't already know how to do it. Keep in mind that your primary responsibility as a guy is to keep your family safe. Fifth on the list having strong verbal and written communication skills. The ability to communicate clearly is essential in all aspects of life, whether it be with your significant other, your children, or your employer. It isn't just a matter of chatting it up. It's about being attentive and getting the meaning. It's all about being able to articulate your thoughts and emotions in a way that's crystal clear and to the point. It is important to have the ability to bargain and to be persuasive. The ability to communicate effectively is one that may be developed through study and practice. Sixth on the list is the ability to create and adhere to a financial plan. It is not difficult to spend money, but it might be challenging to save it. You should have the self-control of a man and be able to create a budget and then stick to it. It has nothing to do with trying to save money. It all comes down to how careful you are with your money. It comes down to being able to provide for your family and having the financial wherewithal to deal with unforeseen costs. These are the six abilities that every guy ought to have mastered. These are only a few examples out of many more, but they should get you started. It is imperative that this epidemic of weak males be stopped in its tracks. Strive to become a man of strength, and pass your knowledge on to the succeeding generation.